Hey everyone, GoBots here, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're here for the divisional round between our Cowboys and the Minnesota Vikings. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a big game. Uh, we're going up against a top 10 defense. We gotta worry about uh, an offense that hasn't been great this year, but they're solid enough. Donald Cook in the backfield, of course. We gotta worry about uh, Justin Jefferson and company. But Dak and company, we have the number one offense in the league. We have a top 10 defense on our own coming into today's matchup. As you see some of the scores down there bottom, the Jets are going to the AFC Championship. 45-24 against the Chargers. Wow. Uh, but y'all, I, I know I haven't had a lot of videos up as of late on this channel, but I'm doing a lot of MLB The Show content over on GoBotch Plus. Link down below for that channel if you're interested in seeing some of our Road to the Show and franchise content with the Texas Rangers. And here's Kirk Cousins. Over 4,000 yards passing, 30 touchdowns as well. We gotta get after him. All right, we're gonna match you guys up according by overall. And we're gonna go boom, boom. Okay. So we're gonna bring a little blitz here. We know, uh, we talked about it last episode. We live and die by our pass rush. And if we can get after the quarterback, and especially one as talented and sneaky at times as Kirk Cousins. Everybody wants to hate on Kirk Cousins, but He's sneaky good at times, but can he perform when it, the going gets tough in these type of situations? Can he be good, Kirk Cousins, or is he going to be bad, Kirk Cousins? Let's see. Oh, yeah, on the ground there. Um, now, we did a little trash talking prior to the game, so all of the players for Wash, uh, for uh, Minnesota are going to have plus 10 break tackle. <laughs> uh, we will have a plus 5 break tackle because of that decision to decide to trash talk. And that's almost picked by Trayvon Diggs. In and out of the hands. We force a stop and it's a 3 and out. Cowboys look at the ball for our first possession. Where y'all saw last, uh, last episode, last game. We were unstoppable. Borderline unstoppable offensively. Can we do that again here today? We'll see as Drake does nothing for us. I'll bring up the Cowboy offense here today. Chance to win and move on to an NFC championship for the second year in a row. The defending champs looking to keep this season rolling. But we're going up against a top 10 defense and our receivers screened each other. That's good. That's just fantastic. Just what we want to see happening is our guys screwing each other up. So we're going to go on the ground here. We're going to pick up a block, and Pollard's going to cut back, get outside, spin back in. Whoop. Let's go, baby. Good run there from TP20. The nice run. We'd love to see it. It's a pretty good blocking downfield there as well. But got outside, went downfield. Don't know if they're going to have guys. They have D Danielle Hunter and Eric. So they got some good guys underneath. But I don't know if they have a lot of guys downfield that can stop us. Right. Scratch that. They do. Scratch that. They absolutely do. As they pick off on a bad pass. An no ill-advised pass on my end. It is what it is. We're going to forget about it. Move on, move on, move on. Pick it. All right, so I, I can't be handing them field position. I've got to take care of the rock. Got to take care of the ball. We're going to bring a mid blitz here. Watch the run up the middle. Nope. Bull rush, and that worked to perfection, but they catch it. Justin Jefferson being covered by Moore. Third, uh, second and one, excuse me. Mm, bringing a blitz off the edge here from Jordan Lewis. We go handoff up the middle, and you're going nowhere, sir. You're going nowhere. You're losing yards. That's a loss of two. Parsons is lively for that one. And uh, here we go. Third and three. Big spot here for this Dallas defense after giving up the pick. And Cousins hits his target out of Thielen. Conversion is completed. And uh, that's a killer. That's a killer. That's a killer. Yeah, incomplete. Throw that crap away, sir. Throw that cat crap away, sir. So we'll take it. We'll take it. Now sets us up here. Second and ten. And Cook. Tackled by Williams, I think, right there on that play. 
So, third and six for Dallas. It's pretty fascinating. Though. Fully expecting pass play here. Could be wrong. Short dump right there. Dead gummit. The zone coverage stuff is not working right now. Not in the slightest. We're going to get out of that and go cover two, man. Breaking us apart right now. Over the middle, caught. A running back? It's not a running back. What are they talking about? I'm a little bit deflated by the way this game has gone now. It's first and goal. Touchdown. That's what happens when we turn over the ball. That gun it. So it is what it is. And we just got to try to do what we can do here. See what we can do here. Nothing. Nothing for him. All right. Uh, got a cover one look going on here. Got our four tight end look. Go. Outrun him, Pollard. Outrun him, Pollard. Beautiful ball. That's a touch pass. Perfection. Touchdown, Dallas. Pollard caught him. He got, he got who he wanted out there. That was a beautiful pass. And catch after that. Harris Smith got picked on. Again, Harris Smith, he can bring the boom. But downfield coverage, not necessarily his forte. As we take him one-on-one, -on -one, and we took advantage of it, and we got a great play there. Well done. You'll love to see it. So, uh, Cowboys tied up. Again, we have the big playability from this offense. We know we can do. We just got to do it consistently and take care of the ball. When we take care of the ball, we're hard to beat. And that'll be tackled down at the 18-yard line. So, first and 10 for Minnesota. After the touchdown, they kind of been feeling pretty good out here. Uh, let's see if the Dallas defense can come up and make a few plays, huh? Shall we? Just drops it in there. Just drops it in there. Damn it. Who jumped? False start. Okay, good. Better back him up. So they call a false start there. Back him up, making it a first and 15 after the catch. We just got to be better man coverage downfield. Right now, Thielen and Jeff Justin Jefferson are destroying us completely. Tackle there by Jones Jr., the rookie. He's had a pretty good rookie year for us. Uh, second and 11 now here. Come on. Take care of the ball. We're going to go off tackle here. And we are not in position. I got caught in my own man. Couldn't get down there to him. So now first down there for Cook. First and 10 for the Vikings at midfield. Get him Parsons. Nice. Short game. Got a yard. Maybe two. Nothing happening. We got him. Finally, we got the pressure. It's Nichols coming in there and dropping Kirk Cousins for a huge sack there. Now makes it a third and 19. Dallas looking to get off the field and get a chance to get the ball back with the lead. So here we go. End of that one. Boom. Come on. Ah, they got good coverage right here. Good pass protection. And they'll throw it away. So to get the stop, we'll get the ball here. We're going to make a punt. London to receive. All right, Cowboys will take on the winner of Detroit and Tampa if we do win this one, that is. Okay, 36-yard line. So, ball 36, Cowboys got to get the ball on the ground here a little bit. 
The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. So the drive's going to start with Pollard. Pollard cut forward, gets four, while Collins hurt on the play. And we battled that last game. We had injuries on the offensive line. Everybody's back healthy. Everybody's good, but I'm a little bit weary of that. Caught. Dropped by Shaheen. Strained shoulder. He'll be back soon. Okay. Should have been a first down catch completion, but he drops it. So third down and six now coming for Dallas. Incomplete. Dak starting his day one for five, passing with a touchdown. Not happy about the way we've started this game through the air. Fair catch called for there at 17 by Smith Mars Marset. First and ten Vikings with a chance to get right back in this thing. Throws it to the other side. He hits him. Oh, a whiffed. That didn't whiff. Seven for ten is Cousins now in the day. Bring it. Oh, my goodness. I thought we were going to break downhill on that and make a nice play. Instead, it's a completion for a short game of four. Second down now here for the Vikings. We're going to go stretch here. We're there. We stop him short of the yard to gain. Third and one. Oh, boy. Don't know what to expect here. Run. Yep. First down. They say he didn't. But they say we stopped him. And they're not going for it. So we're going to end the quarter there. Tied at seven here in the divisional round in the NFC. Cowboys look at the ball when we start things back. All right, for fourth and inches. We're going to get the ball here to Drake London. We'll see what type of punt we get here. It's short again. And couldn't do much of that. We tried to juke and jive a little bit there, but nothing happened. So first and 10 Dallas. Try to stretch her outside here, see what we can do. I try to juke you out, Harrison. Smith. Thank you. Thank you, 25. Pick me up. Let's go a little play action read here, shall we? Burks, if Harrison Smith goes downfield here, we may have a nice play with him. Let's see. Oh, I got Burks all day. That's a touchdown if he can keep running. Hit hard, but we made a nice play and catch. The rookie Burks continues to play well. Again, a guy the Cowboys apparently are real life for actually looking at as well. I, I, I'm a big fan of Traylon Burks. I think the Cowboys would be uh, just very, very pleased with him if we grab him. I think he's a big asset that has NFL stud written all over him. I think he's been disrespected. I know his 440, his 40 isn't great, but man, if you watched him play in the SEC the last couple of years, the dude can ball out straight up as we take a sack, Dad Gummit. Puts us in a tricky pickle here. Third and 20. Wow. Not even close, Dak. So that's an incompletion. Not very happy about it. We'll take the three at least and gives us the lead. 10 7 your score now here, second quarter. As Carter put it through. So not super happy about that uh, development. It is what it is, though. It is what it is, though. All right, here we go. Let's get downfield. Let's make a big play here. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fox trying to tackle. He misses. Okay, down to 30. That's a pretty good return. Pretty, pretty good return there. First and 10 for the Vikings. First and 10. Oh, yeah. We're all over you, sir. 
Nobody plugged the gap. We did instead. And that's a big stop there. He lost a two on the play. For second and 12. Where are you going to go with this one, Dalvin? Oh, man. Good block. That whole play is chalked up to the block Dalvin Cook gave because we had a man coming up the middle. He chopped him out real quick. That whole play doesn't develop unless that block happened, and it did. So credit given right there, Dalvin Cook, on the stop. Now trying to get to him. We got our Cowboys everywhere, and it comes down as they're going to give it to Joseph and I think Basham. You can credit on that one. No, not Basham. Oliver. Ed Oliver. Two got to him. Second and 19 now dropping back here. Big loss. Over the middle, caught by Jefferson. It's another completion, third and four now. We're going to bring it. Pick it. Oh, let's go, Diggs. Terrible throw. And Trayvon Dick says, thank you, sir. As uh, that, that, that right there is pretty much what I expect Kirk Cousins to do in postseason. Throw some stupid bad pass and make something bad happen for their team. So <laughs> let's take advantage of it. Well, they're bringing the house. Oh, they're bringing the house. And we have a man wide open. Got a block downfield. And he will not be touched. Touchdown, Burks. Cowboys expand the lead. Great blocking downfield there on a perfect play action play. Our offense has just got weapons out the wazoo. And right there, we're showing you what we can do with said weapons. So the Cowboys will make it now a two possession game. Just like that, we bounce and fight right back. Cowboys looking good early on in this one today. Uh, if we keep going this way, I, I anticipate we'll win big. Oh, Lewis with a hit down to 20. Put his whole self into that one. And bring him first and 10 for the Viking offense. First and 10. Gonna go off tackle and he's swallowed up. Host of Cowboys there to make the play happen. Second and 10 now for the Vikings. See we got here. We got that two tight end situation here. See we got. We go cut, hit, and Jones Jr. wraps him up, brings him down. Stop there, third and four. Dallas looking to get the ball back and continue to bring the damage. Get to the, get to the quarterback. Taking a shot, feeling, and digs. Incomplete. He forced it out. Great play there. That's a jump ball. You're going to one of your top receivers against one of the top D-backs in the league. For at least intercepting anyway. And he did a good job there. And uh oh. We're able to cut through a little bit. So here we go, Cowboys ball. Up 17 to 7 already. And I'm going to first play. I'm gonna take a shot. Got one safety deep. Got to bite them on the play action here with Dowdle. Got him deep. There's a flag. Caught. Down at the one. What's the penalty? Of course it is. Of course it was. Former Cowboy Xavier Woods picks me off. That gummit. Second pick of the half. I'm, I'm, I'm ticked at myself. Because I just think, I'm thinking, I can take advantage of these guys. I can get anything I want on these guys, which is probably true, but I can't read really with stupid jump balls and let these guys stay in the game with us because now, most likely, they're going to score off this drive and make it a one-possession game when we could have put them down and out early. That's on me. That's a good hit there from Oliver Wade to shake the block. Third and nine, let's get one more. 
fold him up like a lawn chair. So third and nine, they're gonna send Cook out. Ooh. Interesting. That's probably the primary target, I would assume. Now Cousins. They're gonna throw it away. Wow. I thought he had to options to throw to, but he just threw it away. That's a that's a win for this defense, keeping them out of here. And uh, we'll take it. We'll take it 100 percent So punt not gonna be returned here. That's out at the eleven. Not a bad punt. 257 left in the half. Cowboys ball. We're gonna go on the ground. They're ready for it, man. I see. This is why I like to go play action so much because we just have we have them in run block formations. Oh, wide open. Wide open is Dalton Schultz. First down, Dallas. All right, uh, let's go. Strong stretch now. You can challenge all you want, man. That, ain't, that is not gonna get overturned. Easily gonna be a uh, kept. So we'll go on the ground, strong stretch. So the challenge there does Nowhere. Go Terrible the play. Lost your yard. Well, they say we gained a yard. I feel like we lost your yard. Sending you deep. Go. From the shotgun, it's Prescott. He's going to rifle one deep left side. And that will be incomplete. You got to catch that. You got a linebacker on you right there. He's not going to make that play one on one. Just got to tell you, that's not going to be caught by the by 55 old Kendricks there. Not going to, or not Kendricks, uh, whoever that was, 55. Wide open. Go. Nice play. Nice, easy play. So Dak hasn't had a great game so far today, struggling with completion percentage, which is evident. Uh, but when it matters, we're, we're playing the ball in our playmaker's hands. Which, again, I know we're not running the ball a ton right now with Pollard. But we don't have to whenever he can be a great receiving back for us, which is what he's done at times. 5 for 51 today. Second seven. CD catches. CD gets to the 20. Beautiful play. First down, Dallas. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. From the red zone now, Prescott. And that is caught on the right sideline, but out of bounds, says the line jump. Fair enough. Fair enough. Second and ten, Dallas. Caught by CD, walk it in. Walk it in. A dig return run. Uh, reception there. Easily done. It's a man beater. If you run dig routes or, 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 or uh, you know, any of those, or, or zig route, the zig routes are really hard as well to defend. Easily done. And we're on top by three possessions now, and it's... We're at that point, we're saying it's over, but we know better. Got to know better because it's Madden on all Madden difficulty. And what tends to happen? Well, it's going to find a way for the big man to come in there, Shaheen, trying to break him down. So Cowboys defense looking to get one last three and out stop here. I expect them to take maybe a shot downfield here. We'll see. Over the middle, caught, big hits. Timeout called. To be expected. I'm going to blitz. Nobody can break through, and it's going to be incomplete. Just throws it away, survives. Second down. I don't like it. Throwing again on second and ten. Cousins. Hot. And he's got his man Another first down. Second timeout called for. So there's the second timeout. But that's the last. Last timeout. Ooh. So now that really spices up stuff here. Let's see what they go with. Are they going to run bench? Yep. Underneath, caught, dropped. Probably was best that he dropped that. Matter of fact. Now second and 
Cousins again. Little caught. Don't think you have time. One last heave, huh? Cousins. That's fine. No damage done there. 24-7 is your score. We're going to go to the locker room. Cowboys is dominating here in the NFC Divisional Round. All right, second half, Cowboys ball. And uh, let's, let's dominate. Let's continue the domination. Drake London returning. Oh, my goodness. Set up. I mean, couldn't have gotten a better return, really, unless I broke that through, which I thought I did. But it is what it is. Cowboys ball. Looking to end this game quickly. Nothing quite got developed for us there. Oh, wide open. Lead him downfield. Make a nice play. Ooh. Way to get a pretty good hand on that. I'll give him credit. That was pretty good job. He got a hand on that ball, forced it out. On third down, it's Prescott. PI all day. He ran right into me. Thank you. That's a that had to have been a PI. He ran right into me while I was trying to receive that. So we'll take it. Um, let's go to Pollard here on this one. <laughs> okay. The runs may not be what we go for very much right now. The second, I mean, they're, they're doing a good job on us. One on one, catch it. Catch the ball. Hit you right in the hands, Burks. Look at this again. I mean, it's 50-50, it's yeah, but I mean, golly. And then Alexander, I guess, made a play on it, whatever. An aggressive play call falters. As long as they don't get any points off this, I'm happy. As long as it's it's a really doesn't matter. Got him. Let's go. So it doesn't matter. We get the sack. We're gonna get the ball back. The the punts will give us good field position as well. So the pick doesn't matter. Wasted a little bit of time, I suppose, for the Vikings. But you know what? Who cares? We're winning. Try to get outside. Didn't work. So we can go ball on our side. Uh, Let's try run. Yeah, I don't want to talk about the picks. Okay. Good. Good job there. Good run from Pollard. Good run from Pollard there. Only 60 yards of rushing offense for the Dallas offense today. Just fine. They go back to Pollard on second down. And he'll be brought down, losing yardage back at the 40. This will be a loss of three, and now a much tougher third down looming. Third and four. Nine yard run on the previous play. Getting one more yard wouldn't have been much of a problem. But apparently it was. And now it's third down. Flushed out right. On the run. He'll let this go deep right side. Just threw it up. I mean, I didn't know what else to do with that ball. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. Whatever. Instead, it's fourth down. Now Prescott on fourth down. He gets this complete to Shaheen, the tight end. And he gets it to the Keep it going. Come on. Keep it going. 
offense and defense the defense is tired i see it and in this case the offensive guys had to stretch plays don't work because defensively you work on trying not to lose my temper right now cuz i'm i'm getting a little bit agitated by looking at a second and 11 our piss poor rushing looking to throw prescott and they set up the screen that's complete tried the screen play and that'll set up a third down the key to any screen play is all in the deception tell you one man i need to get involved with mari cooper over there but someone gave it up because that one wasn't very well concealed and the defense able to rally good well done there coop nice catch as they're able to get the third down conversion and while we may be looking at the scoreboard this offense certainly is not because they're showing no signs of backing down even with a three score lead here in the third quarter i think they keep taking their shots they've seen blown leads oh boy this league oh boy Dak just trying to run away Dak sliding down at the one probably could have tried to get a touchdown but i just slid to be safe come on baby come on let's get one more to add to it all got it got it let's go this game's over Dominating effort from this offense outside of the three picks done. Imagine if we haven't thrown those three picks. Imagine. We probably have 50. But the Vikings, who apparently have a top 10 defense, are nothing to contend with the number one offense. Their offense that has been very mediocre this year, well, case in point, look at the top scoreboard there. <laughs> uh, yeah, they're not very good. Here comes KJ Osborne. Where are you going, sir? Down at the 17. Closed you up like a book. Come on. Come on. These guys had to punt their last possession, and that's become two for the cook right here. Where are you going? Where are you going? There's nowhere to be run. I mean, there's nowhere to hide. Everywhere you go, there's domination. So, 12. Ooh. Where are you going? Where are you going? That's a pick all day. Never mind. I, I, I digress. It's not. So, third and 12 now. These guys have punted four times already, and they're staring at a fifth, barring a conversion here on third down. That is caught by Thielen. And way up past the 30. <sighs> what route was run right there? With the kind of game he's had so far, you had to know that on third down, that they would be looking his way, and they did for big yardage and a first down. Come on. The defense fell asleep with the switch on that one. I would have doubled him, tripled him, anything to keep the ball out of his hands. Now this one to his tight end out on the right side. And he'll be out of bounds. Second and four. Bring press. Get him. Where are you going, Cousins? Second sack for Nichols today now, and that's a third and 18. Nowhere to hide. Nowhere to run. Third and 18. Maybe see a screen pass, potentially. I would not be shocked by that. I'm going to have Jones out here just in case. Oh, yeah. Give me him. Come here. Yep. Overthrew him. Overthrew him. And uh, Corky, Corky Cussies is in uh, playing very well. And that's a horrific punt. Ah, it had to be caught by Robinson. It was that poor of a punt. That's hilarious. Oh, that's hilarious. So first and 10 Dallas. The game's pretty much done and over with here now at this point. And uh, we're just going to look to, you know, put this game away. We're going to start going two clock actually now, like early, early. Immediately already try to wind that clock down and this thing mercifully. Um, keep guys healthy as best we can as well. Okay, well done there. So third and three. Uh, let's go tight in cross. Oh crap. Thank you, Schultz. 
Oh, I thought through my fourth pick. This offensive game plan has just been sensational. I mean, when you think about all wow. the different ways, they've got their receivers Oof. open so far. All right, last it's play of the season. quarter. Scheme, design, execution. Prescott looks to throw on first. There goes a deep ball in zone. Oh, this one is took my shot at him. That's fine. Second and ten. Dang it. Just missed that one. Opportunity right there to be extremely physical and force that incompletion. Oh, I thought Terrence Seal was going to catch one. End of three. We're going to head to the fourth. Uh, dominating effort from the boys. Dominating. All right. Quarter four. Third and ten. One safety. Moving him over now. Hmm. So we got cover one here. There's my boy CD. Nice catch. Nice conversion. Keep the chains moving. Keep that offense rolling. Keep that defense tired. Keep that clock moving too. Got one. Second and nine for the uh, Cowboys here. Out of the gun. Here's Prescott. Oh. He's to the give me that. And give me the play action right off or the, the pass interference as well. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, is that better for me or worse? Yeah. All right, so first and ten, clock continuing to move. First and goal, actually, matter of fact. We run right here, boom, boom. We broke one. Third, a second and three. Ready for this? Ah, I didn't. Trying a little option. Something we don't ever do. We tried it there, didn't work. It's fine. That's going to bring up a big call now because he's unable to make the play himself on second down. Now you just have to wonder will they keep the ball in his hands on third down? It's a third and goal. Here's third and goal. To throw is Prescott. Escaping the pressure right. Caught it. Let's go. Fourth passing touchdown today for Dak. Doesn't have to be pretty. Doesn't have to be pretty whenever we're our defense is playing as well as they are. Um Going to go to our second straight NFC Championship game to take on either the Detroit Lions or the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, the number one seed. So we'll see who you'll match up with after this game is done. No worries there. I'll show you guys. Let's see who we got. Yeah, you're going nowhere. Down at the 18 yard line. Down at the 18. No harm done for us there. So, um,. Got to expect they're most likely going to try to score a garbage touchdown, which probably will happen. Let's be real. Oh my gosh, okay. Nichols says, get that out of here, sir. Not in my house. Second and 10. I don't remember the last time we kept a team under single, under double digits. I don't remember. Now I'm going to curse myself right there. Watch now. Now it's going to be jinxed and they're going to score a field goal at least, but. Whatever. It's over. We're up by 31. Cousins now. That's fine. That's fine. Check it down. Pick up a couple yards. If it is what it is. Give him a gain of five on the completion. And it'll bring up the second down. Throwing. Cousins. 
Middle of the field to Jefferson. Jefferson caught it first down. Okay, they got momentum going here. This game was decided a while ago. Bringing a blitz. It's going to artificially inflate his passing numbers. So right now, the only one really applauding probably his agent as he thinks about angling for a new contract. First and ten. Come on. To the air again, it's Cousins. Hot. That gummit. Smith has it. And he's going to get this inside the third. Running around like a madman right there on that catch. Certainly pretty well over. They go ahead and mark it in the wind column. But as a defense, they don't want to get so soft. Fully expect pass. Let's get a pick, shall we? Come on, defense. And puts points on the board. They have pride, too, on that side of the ball. So they're definitely going to be in field goal range, but do they go field goal or do they try to score touchdowns? This question if they get in that situation. We need this defensive line to step and make a play in this drive. Come on. Throwing again on second down. Cousins. When an offense reads blitz, come on, D. Come on, D. Tight ends know that they become a big part of the passing game because they should be able to allow garbage touchdown. Aren't we? Garbage touchdown. Oh, wow. Okay. You juked me out of my, my jammies. Good Lord. So, second and three. Run here. You got to run here. Up the middle. Stops. Gain of one. Third down. Let's go engage eight. Risky play, I know. Risky play, but we're going to do it. Get him. Got him. Oh, he stopped him. He didn't get the first down. Great tackle right there. An excellent tackle, matter of fact. That gun that was beautiful. Well, it wasn't a big strike, but that completion put them in really great range. What do we have now? Come on, D. Don't let him get one. Don't let him get it. Don't let him get it. Don't let him get it. No. Whatever. Take your stupid touchdown, Justin. Take it. Just because of that, I'm going to score one more. Always give me nice. It just isn't this thing. No. You score a touchdown on me, I'm going to get 40s on you, but sorry. Suck it up, Buttercup. Uh, onside recovery in case they're going to try. Yeah, they are. They are. They're absolutely going to try for more. Uh, and, yeah, it's about right. The, the, the amazing glitch of onside kicks that they still haven't fixed because EA is, well, you know. Uh, we're going to accept the penalty. So let's keep things rolling here. First down, Dallas. Nobody got him. So a yard there, maybe ish. Ish. Clock winding down. We have 83 rushing yards today, which is. Okay. They, they're a good rush defense team. I'm going to give them credit on that front. I do think they've been a good rush defense today. They've kept us in check. Two minute warning. So, two minute warning here, third down and nine, we'll call it. Cowboys looking to just get out of here and uh, call it a day. They want me to run the football. I say, ah. Uh -uh. I say, ah. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Okay. Okay. As the drive goes so back, the clock winding down. Could take it all the way down to about six. And we have him. Oh, he kept his feet. Worst case scenario. <laughs> I know this game's over with. I was just trying to have some fun there with them. And, uh, man, oh, man, we almost had it. He, they were wide open downfield if we didn't get the hit. Dang it. Dadgummit. Oh, that ticks me off. We had it. 
trying to be cute with it, man. Dang it. That aggravates me. We had it. Perfect execution was there. Yeah, that's about right. Throw it away, Kurt. So, the game's over. There's 107 left. There's no chance, but, you know, they have a chance to make it 38-21, whatever. Oh, so, the Cowboys... I'm not happy about it. God bless, Kurt. Can you get a freaking audible 16 more times? What's it matter? Hot. You gonna call your timeouts now? Stop. Bless it. Cousins on third and two. Oh, they say he didn't get his feet down. That's incredible. Moore somehow forced him off there. Wow. I'm actually shocked. <laughs> oh, fourth and two. Here we go. Get him. Get your hands up. Get. Didn't get it. Are you serious? I thought we stopped him. Okay. Whatever. It is what it is. First and ten. Here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Incomplete. Another incompletion. Come on now. Come on now. Second and ten. Cowboys will be moving on to the NFC Championship. It will be next episode. Say all that. Look at that. Nobody can touch the ball or can pick the ball anyway. Third and ten. Let's do it again. What is happening? Good lord. Seriously, we all have stone hands. It's like Fred Flintstone Barney out here playing with Bam Bam. We can't, I mean, crap, what's going down? It was the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Madden. Stone hand game. Oh, my gosh. Last game. Last play of the game. Come on, my man. Come on, my man. Throw the dang ball. Caught it. Timeout called. Okay. Okay. So they're right there. They're at the two, I think. So they're at the two. Or the one, they say. Pinch. Caught. It's fine. Screw it. Let's just super send the rest of this dumb, stupid thing. Get your stupid uh, garbage points in the stupid game. Over. Ball game. We move on. A little bit soured by the end of that thing, but we dominated these guys. We're going to head to the conference championship next episode. Let's look at the stats for this one right now. Dak threw three picks, had four touchdowns, though, with 330 through the air. Uh, Pollard, 16 for 68 rushing. Uh, mixed it up passing out there. We had two guys in 98 yards, Burks and Pollard each. Uh, four different guys connected to on touchdown passes out there today. Parsons and, well, sorry, Jones is our leading tackler. Nichols had four tackles for a loss along with two sacks. And Diggs had the pick. So Cowboys with a big win. Move on to the NFC Championship for the next one. All right, we're advancing. And you see we are playing Detroit. How? I, Detroit's been a top top 10 offense uh, well, in terms of points per game. Uh, they've been mediocre everywhere else in terms of other areas. But they're number two in total defense in terms of points per, per game allowed. They're seventh in points per game per game in offense. They're eighth in rushing per uh, game, yards per offense per game. Good lord, I can't talk. And they're sixth in defensive rush yards per game allowed. So they're 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 a solid team, and they just beat the Buccaneers, thirty six to twenty nine. Taking a look at that one right now, you can see uh, they they did a good job against these guys. Uh, they're led by Colin Kaepernick, their quarterback, as they they limited Brady. Brady had three fifty four, three touchdowns and a pick. What else can you really do there, right? Uh, but Kaepernick had 294, three touchdowns, no picks. Sacked six times, which tells me we're going to be able to do some damage against these guys. They held them in check on the ground, as you can see. They didn't allow a lot of rushing. Meanwhile, they ran swift freely pretty well out there. Receiving, they got Deontay Harris, uh, Traquan Smith, Richie James Jr., Swift. I mean, they got guys. And uh, they don't allow a lot of sacks. Are they allowed six sacks? I saw they have some decent defensive pieces out here. 
it's gonna be a good game i think but one in which i think we'll be able to win uh you look at the afc side of things you got the colts the number one seed we'll see if we can see them back to back years of super bowl and they're being led by Jameis winston and of course ezekiel elliott who's got 20 for 95 with two rushing touchdowns he led them with four catches 87 yards and a touchdown so it may be zeke returning to play dallas in a super bowl that would be an amazing storyline to follow through through the season we traded them at the beginning of the year beat them in the regular season handily it's limited zeke to hardly anything and now maybe potentially see them in the super bowl but of course we got to win the nfc championship which we'll see soon here on the channel so if you don't want to miss out on that make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell keep it tuned here for all things madden college football and uh, football gaming franchise sports content but thank you again stay safe and god bless to each of you see y'all back here in the next one y'all take it easy